This one runs off software, runs off a laptop, and uses a PS3 game controller. Members of the King County Bomb Unit are brushing up on the latest technology. They're practicing what to do in the event of a bomb threat. Raise it up. On this day, they're using a robot with a high-powered water sprayer to practice destroying a threat disguised in this suitcase. Fire in the hole! You're clear. A very good example of what you can do with water when you use it properly. The unit responds to nearly 200 threats a year, from hazmat situations like meth labs to homemade bomb threats and explosions. They're constantly learning new ways to safely detonate explosive material. Each technician has to be recertified every three years to keep up on the latest bomb technology. They're a group of people that are very dedicated to protecting citizens of King County. Fourth of July in this region is, uh, is our top of our year. It's the apex of our year. Right now, sparkler bombs are one of the more popular and dangerous homemade explosives. They're made up of common sparklers and they're wrapped in a certain way, but whenever you take anything that's common, like sparklers, and turn them into something that's meant to explode, well, right off the bat there, you're creating a Class C felony. King County is also one of the only units to work directly with the hazmat crew. As terrorism started progressing, uh, WMD started becoming more and more likely that was going to happen in the United States. Uh, the Sheriff's Office decided, well, we need someone who needs to be a little bit more of an expert on chemical weapons, biological weapons, radiological weapons, nuclear weapons. So they started to integrate that as part of what the bomb squad does itself. Mendez says this partnership is efficient. They're able to figure out what is a hazmat or bomb situation quickly and dispose of it safely. I absolutely love what I do. It's, it's great working with these guys. Combined, these guys have decades of experience and even more dedication. I enjoy the work. It's a fascinating job. Their primary job, to keep the citizens of King County safe.